Hi, coming by this house in the little town that we live in. <clears throat> this house was built in the 30s. And when it was built, it was one of the prettiest houses in town. Well taken care of, and the family that lived in it was a, a thriving, good family. Now you see what I have behind me. Without anybody living in this house, it's just gone downhill. It's been emptied and it's been cleaned out. But with nobody moving back into it, there's nobody here to take care of it. And ladies and gentlemen, Jesus Christ took up residence in us. He cleaned us out with His Holy Spirit. He cleaned us out with, uh, with His salvation. But if we don't fill up with Him, our house turns into this. The house that the Lord lives in, us, turns into this. We start in decay. Our, our relationship with Christ is something that has to be continuous every day. And without that continuation, that, that constant residence of Jesus in us, we start to fall apart. Now you see this in older Christians who have just kind of gotten complacent in their walk and, and they're empty inside. There's nothing to them. And they sometimes turn bitter and, and, and hate and anger takes over. And folks, if we truly belong to Jesus Christ, our relationship is alive. It's something that's always changing. See, we'll never have dead trees in our yard because we're always cleaning up. Our roof will never be caving in because we're always doing work on our own house. And that's what he requires from us. Folks, as you go about your day to day, allow Jesus to live, truly live within you so that it wells out from you. Hope you have a good day.